Good morning, students. Class eight. Subject is English reader. Chapter ten. The flamingo that flew to the snow. Children, as you all know, this is the story about a flamingo who flew in a wrong direction. Kathy Nihai. She was the founder of Wild Bird Care Center. She wanted to rescue this flamingo. Kathy Nihai and the volunteers make a plan to trap this flamingo, and they have done many things to rescue that flamingo bird. Okay, now here, page number one zero three, second paragraph. By December, the bird's desperate situation had aroused. the public's interest and touched people's heart three nets were donated when an appeal went out for more were needed then a call was received your nest are arriving tomorrow it is our contribution said the representative of the local newspaper the nets arrived on 5th december and nihai Hamlin and ten volunteers spent six hours building a trap across the creek. What is the meaning of creek? Creek means a strip of water flowing into the land from the sea or river, or you can say lake. That is creek. Okay. Now here, what happened? As you all know that this volunteers and Kathy Nihai needs more nest to rescue this flamingo. so they have information that they are getting three nets from the representative of the local newspaper the nest arrived on 5th december and hamlin nihai and tell volunteers spent 6 hours for making a plan to trap that flamingo getting now just see the last paragraph they drove poles into the ground on on either side and stretched the netting over three sides and crossed the top on either side of the trap door they built blinds of straw and leaf working in pairs volunteers began a 24 hours wiggle what is the meaning of wiggle here means action of keeping watch or guarding is passed but not once did the bird enter the trap this is crazy am i doing this watch kept asking himself as he waited in a fresh pre dawn darkness but what had begun as a desire to please his children had become a quest then a cold wave hit and ice formed over a, over the creek the flamingo disappeared two days passed the many thoughts she had succumbed it to the elements what happened they were making plan to trap that that to trap this flamingo they started stretching the netting over three sided and the they left one side for the front as a door okay they started working in pairs and just keeping watch on that flamingo watch was very frustrated for watch was very frustrated to doing this watch was very frustrated and he uh, was asking himself why he is doing this work after keeping god also the flamingo disappeared and and after two days they thought that because of the exposure to the cold she may be died now just see page number 104 on 10 december with still no sign of her nihai and hamlin decided to take her trap down they could no longer keep maintaining it 24 hours a day it was time to admit failure 
Nihai was putting on waders to get into the river and free the trap from the ice when someone ran up. There she is. The, the flamingo stood just 20 meters away. They rushed to break up the ice in the trap. Nihai was so excited she scarcely noticed her bare hands were freezing. Walsh arrived and joined them. When the ice was gone, they took up their hiding places. Come on, Bert. Let your stomach get the better of you, Hamlin said to himself as the hungry flamingo pecked at the ice. Desperate to get at food, then the bird heard the faint bubbling of running water coming from the trap. She stepped into the netted area, submerged her head in the water and began to feed. What happened? On 10th December, the volunteers as well as Nihai was not getting any information regarding this flamingo. So they thought that she will not come again and might and might be she died. So they decided to take the trap down. Okay. After some time, when she was Nihai was planning, someone rang and and gave the information about the flamingo. The flamingo was 20 meters away. Okay. And Nihai was so excited. Walsh also joined them again. And again they started working on the flamingo trapping. Getting? Walsh put his hand in the air and as the bird turned towards the back of the trap, he threw his arm down. Now, a signaled Hamlin rushed into the net, grabbed the flamingo and clutched her to his body. She did not struggle with a huge grin. Hamlin kissed the top of her ruffled head. As you all know that Fleming stepped into the netted area and he started her head in the water and began to feed. Walsh gave signal to everyone and Hamlin rushed into the net, grabbed the flamingo and clutched her. Miss, their plan was successful now. Okay? The story of the rescue was widely reported when pictures of the rescue flamingo appeared on the front page of Ottawa newspapers the next day. It seems the whole city let out a sign of relief. What happened? After rescuing flamingo, this story was now appeared on the page of Ottawa newspaper and everybody, every one of that place relief now and the life of this flamingo was saved by volunteers as well as Kathini Hai. Thank you children. This chapter is over now.